Many people think that photons, which are essentially light particles, or more precisely, the quanta of electromagnetic fields, do not have mass. But how is this possible? Is there a reason why photons do not have mass? When we look at Einstein's famous mass-energy equivalence equation E equals mc squared, is actually a special case of a slightly longer formula known as the energy-momentum relation, which is written out as E squared equals P squared multiplied by C squared plus M squared multiplied by C to the fourth power. This equation relates energy, E, to rest, mass, M, the speed of light, C, and momentum, P, which is the key to how photons can carry energy but have no mass. When a particle is at rest, it has no momentum, and the equation simplifies to the more familiar E equals mc squared. But if a particle has no mass, the equation becomes E equals pc. But wait, you might be asking, how can a particle have momentum without mass? That's where light's duality as both a wave and a particle comes into play. Unlike a particle, whose momentum is related to its mass, a wave's momentum comes solely from its motion, meaning that it can carry momentum even without mass. Interestingly, something that has neither mass nor momentum has no energy, which means it is nothing at all, that is, it cannot exist. But photons do exist, so it follows that they can never be at rest. And the only speed that remains the same in every reference frame is the universal speed limit, c. Light isn't the only massless particle, however. Gluons, massless particles inside atoms, also travel at the speed of light. If you want to learn more about space and stay on top of astronomy, news, and updates, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.